Right. All right, we're live. Hello, everyone. This is Hello. Omar from the What's Third up? Rail. This is the trio. We got the the admiral. We got him back from the Red Sea. He was busy chasing the Houthis. Uh, we got the, Mr. Hammer, the good-looking, handsome, six feet two man who's only two percent of the population. What's up, Mr. Hammer? How you feeling? Um, I'm feeling good. I'm. <clears throat> and I'm, I'm, feeling bit, I'm feeling a lot less sick than I was last week. Um, so You're still battling nice. that COVID, man. Um, not really, not anymore. So oh. hopefully, hopefully uh, things look up. I don't know. <laughs> so the admiral looking nicely. He got his hair down. He, I think he must have been went crazy for a couple of two weeks. I did. Yeah, partying all <laughs> yeah, over I the saw place. Saw a little bit of it. Yeah. Where? Uh, where? And then well, the dolphins. His, Damn you, feet? Shadow the Dolphin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, he's looking good, having fun. I like, oh man, I wish we were in Texas. We could have been there, right, to party with him. You understand? Because uh, um, he, I, 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 I'm positive he knows how to put on a good time. Yeah, we, got a keg, we still got a keg in the back. I'm like, uh, <laughs> it's it's tapped. It's ready to go. I might be going sneaking keg. off later to go fill, do some keg stands by myself. What do you guys drink? But why is it down there? Oh, Bud Light. Uh, do, let me ask you a question. Do you think I'm fucking drinking Bud Light? Oh, you're not. No, I think you're, you're still boycotting the mother. I I'm not drinking no goddamn Bud Light. I, I don't drink at all. I have never drank all my life. So. Listen, Dylan Mulvaney can keep his Bud Light. I'm gonna drink the national. That, yeah, that that, that, that was the stupidest <laughs> thing they ever did. I, it didn't make, no, and they picked the ugliest uh, uh, one of them all. I mean, they, if they pick one of those beautiful ones, those shoes. I, you know? I really agree with. Who was it? Was it Candace Owens or was it? Um, huh? No, it what was. What's the blonde one's name? Um, uh, uh, Liz, Liz Wheeler. No, no. Uh, she's on Fox. She used to be on Fox News. Uh, oh yeah, Lauren. Th Lauren Thompson. Lauren. Uh, Tom Lauren. Are you talking about no, no, she's hot. Tommy Lauren. I'm not talking about, but I'm talking. Well, what's her name? She's like a lawyer. She used to be a lawyer. Oh, um, Megan, Megan Kelly. Megan Kelly. But she goes, "Dumb lady is making fun of real women." I was yeah. like, "That's right, that's right, Megan Kelly. You tell them." This is the strange thing. I will always say that corporate America should stay out of uh, uh, social issues. If they want to donate, they could donate privately to to organizations to. Uh, Anything they want is okay, but don't try to push your uh, views on uh, on society as, as a whole. On another society, I don't this know. Sounds kind of anti-capitalist. I got. Yeah. Okay. I have. I have a prop today. I have the first national flag of Texas, yeah. the Zavala flag, right here. We're ready because hey, if the U.S. government and the Supreme Court want these fucking hands, they can goddamn get them. We're sick and tired of this bullshit. It will take us 10 minutes to work Texas with our Apaches. 10 minutes to work you Wait, guys out. In 10 minutes, it'll take us 10 minutes to hand them the whoopings, bro. We're the <laughs> only state with our own grid. We're the only state with our own branch, the reserve. We're the only state with its own Navy. We're the only state with uh, uh, control of some of the nukes with our National Guard. We make up uh, what 10% of the U.S. military alone. Let me tell you, they want to come and get these hands. We're going to give them the hands. Our National Guard is the same size as like the next five biggest states combined. We are ready for the war. So, so what's going on right now? Where are you guys with the standoff? Uh, uh, who, who's back? We down? told them to get fat. They, we told them to get bent again today too. In fact, Biden administration came out today and said he told the f federal agents not to escalate things. You know why? Because they knew we were ready to throw the hands. Bunch of baby like bitches is what they are. I, I, you know, I'm going to tell you they're both full of shit. You know why? I'm going to break it down for you. The, the area. Where they have these uh, fences, it's a very dangerous area. So there's not a lot of people going in. You know where the you know where the worst place is? Wrong. The, the main port, the, the the door right there. The, the, they You're wrong. In. Huh? You're wrong. Dan Patrick, the okay, Dan so. Patrick, the lieutenant governor, was just down there today. It's an area called Shelby Park. It's an hour from my house. I can drive there right now. Just just last year, thousands of people daily were coming through Shelby Park. You can sit up there with binoculars and watch them coming in droves. It looked, like, guys. It, it looked like the horde from War, uh, Warcraft. It looked like the orcs were coming streaming from Mordor into here. It was a thousand people like every hour on the on the hour coming through. We put up those barriers. Guess what? We had nobody 
crossed the border since we put those barriers. Congratulations to the words of Dan Patrick. We did your job for you, for you U.S. government. Y'all want to talk about securing the border? Texas did it. Y'all can go on and sit, take home. We did it for you. You're Admiral, right. the real problem is at the main door, the front, right? Did they come in legally, 4,000 a day? All they have to do is say I'm is... I'm not worried about the legal immigrants. We've got a problem with that. They have to say no, they're not, they're not asylum. legal immigrants. So they're not legal. They're not, they're not legally... They're not illegal. They're, not, they're, 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 legal they're, they're legal because well, they're, they're, they're asylum... The asylum no, seekers, so just, they're, no, they're not uh, legal. No, it's no. Not legal. Okay, so there's asylum seekers who are coming here illegally, and then there's also the people who are here on work visas who are overstayed their visas. Both of them yeah. come here legally, and then they stay illegally. No, that's not even what's happening people. either. I mean, that's some of it, sure, but it's like a that, drop in the bucket. They have what's it's happening. Not a drop in the bucket. It it's always been the majority. Here, here's what the majority is. This is as of last year, as of since Biden administration took over, and, and actually towards the end of the Trump administration. This is what it really has been happening: is we are having hundreds and hundreds of thousands of people. I think it's up to four million. The estimates are between four million and nine point three million people have come through <laughs> since Biden has taken over. Uh, I don't know if I really believe the nine point three. They're walking right through legally. No, they're not. They're walking through illegally. They get here. The border patrol catches them because they're not making a hard. Forget hard about dip. those. I'm and talking about the caught. ones that come through the doorway through the. the, the I'm not talking about that. that, that that's, one that's thing. what the that's, problem is. No, that's not the problem. The problem 4, is four thousand a day, three thousand no, a day. That's, that's nothing. That's that's fine. What we're talking about is we have millions of people are coming through illegally, and then they're immediately getting caught once they reach this side because they're coming through like areas that are populated. They come through immediately, get caught, and then we don't have the infrastructure to house all these people. It's like millions and millions and then they immediately after they get here they apply for asylum that's they're like hey asylum that's what, like the only words they know in fact here's the worst part is there are tiktok pages put out by the biden administration walking through them steps on how to claim this shit so how come the um the republican party uh killed oh, the bill oh because that bill was bullshit it was but to give 60 million to ukraine and give us 20 million 20 billion here that 20 billion i can fucking raise 20 billion going door to door that ain't gonna do nothing that, that shit is wait, bullshit what? that what? bill that bill was the worst fucking bill i've ever Hammer. seen i think thank he's still god. celebrating <laughs> thank god they fucking shut that bill down but that it's bill is, is everything the republican asked no, it for wasn't. it was absolutely unacceptable he wrote the republicans wait, wait, wrote wait, it wait. republicans wrote it yeah they they yeah, appeased they were rhinos right the Republican and everything, but name only, basically. Them motherfuckers were not Republicans. They betrayed the Republican Party. They were over here sitting, putting this bullshit bill that was just something the Democrats were going to be able to see. And go, look, we did something when it was going to do absolutely nothing. I'm so glad that they fucking shut that bill down. Wait, Thank God. So your problem with that bill is that, like, the, uh, when they gave twenty billion uh, to like Republicans, they and they give twenty or they give sixty sixty billion to America and no. 20 hey, billion let me ask you in America. Question. What state do you live in? Uh, I live in Idaho. Okay, all right. Let me give you an example. Potatoes! Okay, go ahead. Okay. So, like, say you got – y'all are famous for your what? Potatoes? Yeah. Yeah. All right, <laughs> say, say uh, the Ku Klux Klan was coming and burning all the potatoes – <laughs> Billions of dollars worth of potatoes every day, burning them. <sighs> okay. All right. And then, so the U.S. government goes, hey, we could actually stop this problem. But instead, we're going to give $60 billion to Ukraine, and then we're going to give $20 billion to people that have been giving buses to the Ku Klux Klan to come up here and burn your potatoes and say, hey, they're going to stop this problem for you. Would you be pissed? Okay, so well, we, I was just – You, you would be pissed. You would be pissed. I was – Clarifying the numbers, I thought you said like sixty million and twenty uh, sixty million to uh, Ukraine and twenty 60 billion. Million. It's sixty billion. Sixty billion. billion. Okay, so it seems like they were just in. So it seems like they were basically combining bill. two bills together, mm -hmm. right? Well, they do that all the time. Yeah. So I mean, you can. I guess. Yeah. I guess that's just how politics works. Yeah, right? but it's bullshit. We shouldn't be. They shouldn't see one red cent until we fix our goddamn border. That's what I'm saying. Fuck the Ukrainians. But that we got problems was a here. Star. You that know what? You know what? I, I, I even like Israel. I know that we all disagree on whether we are Israel yeah. and what and whatnot. But oh, tell you what, mind, there shouldn't be one red cent given to another country and fr uh, from our taxpayer dollars until Great. they fix this goddamn border. That's what should be done. I'm so sick of this shit. It's a goddamn invasion. Like, I could go outside right now. I literally, not, I could go 50 <laughs> feet from my house. This is not a lie. This is 100% truth. I go 50 feet from my house. And there's a homeless camp right outside my house. And they just cleaned out the homeless camp two weeks ago. You know who the new homeless camp is? Illegal yeah. aliens that are from the, from, that came through from Eagle Pass. Every single one of them. I, I, right now. Right now. And they just cleaned it out last week. 
Yeah, but the, this bill will have at least uh, covered some holes until we get until Trump becomes president. Listen, so you want that so you bill? Want, that bill is. So you like, want to keep the you want to keep the crisis going and people coming illegally no, no, every day? No, that Another is, five that, million this people. This is what was going to happen with that bill. Is huh. this is basically like say the Hoover Dam is crashing, cracking, and someone goes and sticks their finger in one little hole, and then they're like, "Oh, this is this is protecting the border now." And while the rest of the dam is falling over, and then when people go, "Oh, well, what happened?" The Dems can go, "Look, we did something about it." And no. We're not. Let's not let them have this fucking bullshit Pyrrhic victory. That's not even a real win. I'm. I, I'm glad that Matt Gates and the rest of the Republicans stood up and said, "No, sir," because this bill was bullshit. Wait, you, why, why was it bullshit? Like, what well, was it? Was it not well, enough. It's not enough. Not enough. Well, I mean, it's it, it would help, right? Like that's like that's the, like going, oh, you're having you... heart surgery, you're having heart failure. Let me go get a squid heart and put it in there. Even okay, though squids but aren't compatible with humans. You, Here's the thing is that, like, the um, the United States budget isn't just the Republicans to use. The Democrats are also a part of the country. Oh, they gosh, have a right so to that, use a... Yeah, and so they're complaining about us shipping they, immigrants to them. So well, suddenly it's a problem, but now they're well, over well, well, we're not I voting. Get, I get, I I get mean, we'll, we'll complain. I mean, so I guess Democrats will complain about it, but we're not... We don't really care enough to pass laws about it. Yeah, so it is what it is. So we're gonna. Then, I mean, that's your but, problem. And so that you is our problem. To... You're absolutely correct. It is our problem. And then the you and that's what's funny about that. We actually went and did something about it. And then the Biden administration is going and cutting down our fences. Okay. Well, you're okay. What if I were to say? So like, wait, you can't have a no, 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 no. Here's okay. Imagine I have a problem with my neighbor, and he's like, huh? he, he's like, fence. I build a fence, your right? Whatever. Okay. Okay. Sure. 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 So um, I say I build a fence and then his dog, like there's like a hole in it. And his